Hello guys, today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get a checkerboard with Black Jogger's modded outfit after the latest patch of 1.50. If you do go on to enjoy today's video, please like this video and subscribe to the channel as it's much appreciated. To start off the glitch guys, you're going to want to go over to the pause menu and go down to swap character. This outfit is only working on male characters as of right now and your male character has to be in the left slot. So once you're at the swap character menu guys, you're going to want to create a female character or have one in the right hand slot. So go ahead and create a female character, I'm going to create one right now guys. If it asks you if you want to transfer your rank, select yes. So once you load in guys, sometimes when you load in, there is no clothing shop. If that happens to you, just press find new session and load in and make your way to the clothing shop. Once you're at the clothing shop guys, you're going to want to copy the outfits I create guys. So to start off with guys, you're going to want to go over to accessories and you're going to want to take off any earrings and any accessories that you have on. So cuffs and earrings, make sure there's no cuffs or earrings or it will mess up the glitch so from there guys we're now going to be doing our first outfit so go to the top section guys and go down to uh, leather jackets from there you're going to want to copy the outfits I create so we're going to be putting on the blue uh, JC jacket so it should be number 32 guys so just put the blue JC jacket on number 32 so once you put that uh, jacket on guys you now going to want to go all the way down to uh, have a look so yeah we're going to sports tops today and we're going to be going down to this sports top right here so pause it if necessary guys you can see so you're going to want to put the sports top on from there you're going to want to go to the pants section guys you're going to want to go down to utility pants I'm going to put on the black battle pants so that's right at the bottom you'll see them the black battle pants from there guys you're now going to want to make your way over to the shoe section where we're going to go to boots from there guys we're going to be putting on the flight boots so it's right at the bottom again guys, you'll see it, the flight boots, black flight boots. So now what you're going to want to do guys, is you're going to want to go over to the accessories. And you're going to want to go down to gloves. And we're going to be putting on the black woolen gloves. So, uh, let me have a look. I think it's up here. So the black woolen gloves number 50. So put on the black woolen gloves guys. Once you've done that you can now um, save your outfit. Make sure you save it into slot 1 guys. So save it into slot 1. I recommend you num name the outfit number 1. From there you're now going to create the second outfit. So to create the second outfit you're going to want to go down to uh, Sports tops, and we're going to go down to this one, the grey, you'll see it, the sports top, this one. Put this one right here, uh, and then what you're going to want to do now, guys, is we're going to go to uh, utility vests. I'm going to try and find it. Alright, so it's this vest right here, guys. 
uh, the stealth one, I think it's called stealth utility vest. Once you've put the stealth utility vest on guys, you're going to want to go to sports pants and you're going to want to put on these spotted muscle pants. So once you've put the spotted muscle pants on guys, you're now going to want to go to the shoe section. From there, you're now going to want to go down to uh, high heels and you're going to be putting on the uh, chocolate, I think it's called. I'll try and find it now guys. And then we're putting on the charcoal platforms. So the charcoal platforms are these shoes for the second outfit. So from there guys, you're now going to want to go to accessories and you're going to want to go down to gloves and we're going to be putting on the light woodland tactical gloves. So that's number four on gloves. Now what you're going to want to do guys, you're going to want to go to the desk and you're going to want to save this outfit into slot two. So now for the final outfit guys, you're going to want to go over to the top section and you're going to want to go down to Austeers. Uh, we're going to be putting on the um, blue. So this one right here, just put this Austeer on. Yeah, put that one on. And from there you're going to want to go up to the work jackets I think I need to find work jackets now it's under sports jackets guys so go to sports jackets and go up till you find the green one so it's greenish colour this one right here guys so put this one on put that sports jacket on and then you're going to go to the um, glasses section we're going to be putting on the casual glasses so we'll go to casual and we're going to be putting on the cardboard, uh, copper marble uh, glasses so yeah put the copper marble glasses on these ones right here guys and you're going to want to go to the desk so go over to accessories and we're going to be putting on the necklace so go to necklaces guys and I believe it's right near the bottom somewhere and it's free by the way um, this necklace right here so put this necklace on the black heart and then you can save this outfit into slot 3 So now what you're going to want to do after you've created the outfits guys, you're going to want to choose the easy way out. Once you load back in guys, you're now going to want to hit pause menu, go over to online and go down to creator. From there guys you're going to want to create a race, a land race and you're going to want to fill in the details what I do right now. So the race details, the title, just put it as a random letters, description random letters again, take a random photo guys, but the players need to be set to 2 and the route type needs to be set to point to point, placement you're going to want to place your trigger. checkpoints you're going to want to place the checkpoints all the way to 0.70 miles make sure it's around 0.70 it doesn't matter if it's above just as long as it's above 0.65 you should be good if you do go on to enjoy today's video Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Any issues with the glitch, so, uh, guys, 
you're going to want to just comment it down below and I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. So as you can see I'm testing the race guys. To test the race you just complete the race, that's about it. Once you tested the race you should see the alert, accept that alert guys. From there you're going to want to go to the pause menu and go over to online, go down to choose character or swap character. From here guys we're now going to be deleting the female character so to delete the female character just press X on the character and delete just type delete once you load back in guys you're going to want to press B to back into story mode this is an important part guys you don't want to be going into online make sure you press B to back into story mode or it will mess the glitch up so you're going to want to start a GT online session once you're in story mode once you load into the GT Online session guys, you should see the outfit you was wearing before you started the glitch. Just go ahead and save this outfit into an empty slot. As you can see guys, my outfits are going to be transferred so you can see number 1, 2 and 3. Make sure you save your current outfit into an empty slot to save that outfit. So from there, you're now going to want to go over to online and go down to jobs. Rockstar created and it's on versus. You should see the crooked cop job. You're going to want to start that up. Once loading guys, make sure the clothing is on player owned. You can join with a friend or some random player. As you can see right now, I've loaded in with some random player. Doesn't matter if you have a friend or not. As long as you're in a job with player owned outfits, it should work for you guys. Perfectly fine. Once you come on this screen right here, guys, you're going to want to go once to the right on clothing, on current outfit, and then you're going to want to ready up. Once you load into the job guys, you're now going to want to put on an earpiece or a rebreather. So go down to style, go to accessories and go either once to the left, once, once to the left or once to the right on gear. From there you can now quit the mission and load back into online. Once you load back into online, you're now going to want to go to a clothing shop guys where we're going to be putting on the racing gloves and deleting the uh, slot number one. You should see your outfit is transferred uh, from here so go over to the accessories bit in the clothing store guys and you're going to want to go down to gloves and you're going to want to scroll through till you find the racing gloves race suit gloves um, and then you're going to want to go to the desk and you want to want to delete the first outfit so make sure it says empty key on number one 
From there guys, you're now going to want to go to online, and you're going to want to start up Crooked Cop Job again. Once you're loading guys, you're going to want to do the same thing as before, you're going to want to set the clothing to player owned, and you're going to want to wait for someone to join the job. So once you're on here, you're now going to want to go twice to the right, and you're going to want to ready up. You should see the outfit appears, guys. A full checkerboard outfit with black joggers and racing gloves. Really nice looking outfit, guys. Once you load into Crook Cop guys, we're going to want to do the same thing as last time, we're going to want to put on a rebreather or an earpiece. So once you've put the rebreather on, you're now going to want to quit the job again. And once you load into GTA Online guys, you should see the outfit is on. You're going to want to run straight to a local clothing store or a gun shop and save that outfit into any slot. Thank you for watching today's video guys, if you did enjoy this video and got the outfit, please like this video and subscribe to the channel as it's really appreciated. We're very close to 10k subscribers guys, nearly there. Thank you for watching, I will see you in the next video, peace out guys.